What is happening, Magnesites? Be sure to come out and see me at the 2018 Urban Action Showcase and Expo. Tickets and more information in the description box. And do not forget to use the promo code Magnesite. They are teasing how Vegeta unlocked his Super Saiyan God, which we've all wanted to know. It's like, how the hell did he do it? You know, we accepted it, but we want to know how. And my favorite character in the series is now set to maybe be unveiled on how he did it. it says here on comicbook.com, Dragon Ball Super teases how Vegeta unlocked Super Saiyan God. Dragon Ball Super is finally giving Vegeta a Super Saiyan God debut via an upcoming Dragon Ball Super Broly movie. Fans have been liking the promo images of the film's designs for Super Saiyan God. Vegeta, while simultaneously wondering and speculating why the storyline of Broly movie requires Vegeta to, Vegeta to transform into Super Saiyan God form alongside Goku until now. Thanks to information found in some recent Dragon Ball Super candy card merchandise. We have a better hint as to that answer. So it says here, using the key of the gods gained from training with the Hakashin and Whis, Vegeta achieves a superior evolution. He cloaks himself in a red aura to reach the realm of the gods in this miraculous transformation. Mm hmm. Let's see here. Super rumors. Did he begin his long training with Whis out of frustration at losing to the Hakashin Beerus? Probably. Anyway, this obliquely implies he got it through training rather than the ritual. But that bit could have been taken from the super anime without much thought. Remember, this is just an insert in a chocolate pack. So anything that's not a big plot detail is suspect. Mm -hmm. All right, so it says the translator is clear to point out that we have to be careful about how we interpret the last bit about Vegeta's training with Whis. It would be easy to take it as indication that there's a major change to Super Saiyan God being made in Dragon Ball Super Broly, but that's not necessarily the truth. First of all, Vegeta's Super Saiyan God form and his ability to manifest, it will instead of ritual have been previously established in canon via the Dragon Ball Super manga. During the manga's Future Trunks saga, Vegeta briefly manifests Super Saiyan God during a battle with future Zamasu and Goku Black in order to taunt the evil Kais with Saiyan Divine Power to jump from Super Saiyan God to Super Saiyan Blue. That means a lot of fans already know the power of Super Saiyan God is achievable through training or power up. And it's just yet another loose end from anime continuity which Dragon Ball Super Broly is being tasked with cleaning up. Indeed, Dragon Ball Super Broly seems to be reframing the power of Super Saiyan God as something important to the history and powers of the Super Saiyan race. We know that both Vegeta and Goku will manifest that form at some point before a major fi uh, final fight with Broly who will tap into an ultimate Super Saiyan power that is as uncontrollable as it is limitless. <laughs> Woo! There are even quite a few fans who believe that Goku and Vegeta will tap into their Super Saiyan God forms to unite into Super Saiyan God Gogeta in order to give fans an epic finale to the film. That would be lovely. How do you think Super Saiyan God will factor into the story? So what do y'all think? What do y'all think? I mean, that's and I would I would love to see that. 
I would love to see Super Saiyan God Gogeta. I would love to see that. All I know is this, is that my three favorite characters in the whole series are in this movie. Vegeta, Goku, and Broly. Okay? My favorite movie villain and my two favorite characters in the series. All right. The only thing that would be more perfect would be if it was Cell. I hope Cell makes a comeback. Please, I think they are. You know, Broly has a massive following. I think that Cell is going to be back. I think Cell is coming back. Cell is one of the most unstoppable villains that they could ever... They're lucky they got him when they did. You get what I'm saying? They're lucky they got rid of him when they did. Because Cell... Man... And I hope the guy returns to do his voice, too. <laughs> that would be perfect. So, post comments down below. Let me know what you all think. And if you enjoyed my reaction, hit the like button. Well, not my reaction. My video, hit the like button, subscribe, and share. And if you did not, that's fine. Because you can kiss my perfect derriere. <laughs> 10 million subscribers. Woo! You may now... Subscribe.